Todd. Four years for Grand Theft Auto. And that's Danny. Five years for Battery, but released early for good behavior. And him, Joey, that's Charlie's nephew. Poor kid is hanging with the wrong crowd. And Charlie spent more nights in prison than his own bed. Cops never find a way to convict him, though. So this broad had $60 to her name. So she says. So, what'd you do? What'd I do? I took her $60 and her car. <laughs> are you kidding me? It's not my fault her husband left her without a thing. Jesus, you are such a prick, Todd. Kid's got a point. You are all kinds of crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've known you two to do a lot worse. Remember a couple of weeks ago when we knocked off those yuppies? You know what I'm talking about. July 19th, our 20th anniversary. What the hell were you thinking, huh? What were you thinking? Where's your brains? This was supposed to be a simple grab and snatch operation. No big deal. And when the hell did you start packing heat on the job? Listen, they did it themselves. They were supposed to go to the safe and get out. How about Joey over here? We're roughing them up a bit, huh? Charlie, you taught him well. They tied us up, blindfolded my wife, then beat her to death. That broad would not shut up. If I could, I would put a bullet in both of them. Yeah, what was her name anyways? Michelle. Marie, my wife Marie. So Charlie, what's up? Why'd you need to talk to us? The Broad's husband is alive. I don't know how. I don't know where. And I don't know who he told about us. I told you, we needed mass, Todd. Did you see all that blood? How does some regular old Joe take a beating like that? I mean, I should have put it in a bullet in their head when I had a chance. My friends on the inside told me it was an inside job. He did 10 years overseas in the Marine Corps or something. Special Forces, 10 years of living in the dirt, tinkering with wires, and dismantling IEDs. Now, we gotta find this guy and finish him off. You know what I mean? They're probably gonna put his ass in the witness protection program. I'll make some calls. Maybe we can find out where he's at. Who's to say this guy doesn't come after us first, huh? No way this guy can find us. Mask or no mask. So what are you saying? Do we need to watch ourselves now? Yeah. If we see him, we just... Y you won't. Then how do we get into his own house? I was on leave. It was our anniversary. All I'm saying, boys, is just watch out for yourselves. He's out there somewhere. You know what I mean? And kid, do yourself a favor. Go see our cousin Vinny out on the West Coast. He owes me. Take some money with you. Go hide for a while. I don't think he's going to harm you. You're such a young guy. What about us? Look, I hate to say this, but I'm gonna have to put some jobs on the back burner for the time being. You know what I mean? That's it. Lay it low. So, we're just supposed to roll over and let this guy come get us? Just lay low. Nothing. 